all right guys welcome back it's shimori and today we're going to be taking a look at this um anki or is it anke nk am i sure to pronounce it um it's a security camera and um i'm going to well i guess i'll go ahead and share with you uh some of the features that it has um for the features it has remote monitoring um which you can uh, monitor the camera while you're away from home or uh, from somewhere else in the house. Um, it has uh, what they call impressive or PIR detection, which is uh, body temperature detection. Um, and then it has uh, a 355 wide view coverage. Um, it's a 1080p, 1080p, 1080p video. And let's see what else. Um, what else does it say it has? I think that's about it. Oh, also two-way radio, uh, two-way audio. Um, that's when um, it has a built-in speaker and microphone, which you can communicate, um, I guess, through the app. I guess you could say through the app somehow. Um, uh, Around-the-clock protection. Um, also has night vision, so it uh, records video at night. Um, let's see, a uh, motion triggered email alarm, uh, I guess you can get a, a, a email, uh, alarming you if there is some, I guess some, uh, unexpected movements that the camera detects. Alright, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you what's in the box, so let's get started. Alright, so let's see, you get the camera. Let me take this out. The camera itself. Alright, so um, the camera itself. Um, there's a box. What's in here? Um, looks like the plug. What else is in here? Looks like some mounting screws to uh, mount it up on the wall. And here is the power adapter. Looks like there's another box in here. And here we get... Is there anything else I heard now? Alright, looks like we get a... A, uh, looks like a software disc and some uh, manuals and the Ethernet cable and then you get the uh, mounting um, plate or stand All right. so let's take this out of the box out of this box pull that off any way that I could take this out okay, so um got the camera out um as you can see uh, there's the camera itself and um this looks like um I think this may be the lead indicator light or I'm not sure what that is Maybe for night vision or something. Um, and then on the side, you get the speaker. And then on the back, you get your Ethernet port um, audio out. So I guess you could uh, maybe hook, uh, I don't know, some type of speaker, speaker to it or something. Um, there's power port. You can also reset it. And then there's a QR code, I think, uh, for the app. Um, and then here are some, let's see, let's open this, uh, there is, um, the SD card slot and WPS, I think that's for like, um, I'm not sure what that's for, I'll probably put it up in a video somewhere, uh, and show you guys. Um, what else does it have? 
and on the bottom is where that plate will go for uh, mounting uh, if you wanted to mount it to a wall or something and that's pretty much it that's all you get on it you don't get anything else oh yeah this is the mic uh, and the speaker I know I mentioned that again um, and then the inky logo and that's pretty much it so I'm going to go and get this um, hooked up and so we can test this thing out all right guys so um, now I'm gonna plug it in go ahead and plug the power in and as you can see you can, I don't know if you can see that there's like a indicator light down there I don't know if you can see that very well it's blue um, I don't know if you can see there's some LED lights around here So um, now um, I'm going to connect it to the app and the app is called Anki Vision. So I'm going to open that up. Alright, so it says that we have to register for an account. So I'm going to take a minute to do that. Alright, so I am now um, registered. So it says click her to add a device. And I guess I just kind of scanned that up. I don't know if it's that QR code. And it looks like it recognized it. Um, connect to a network. Wired wireless. So I'm going to type in a password. So it says it is connecting. Registering on the server, linking the device to your account. So. Alright, it says the device is not activated yet. Please set a password to activate the device. So I'll go ahead and set a password. Alright, so I just set the password. Alright, please input the device code. Input the device verification code. Find the verification code on the device label. If no verification code on your device, input the default. Okay, so it says it's on the device somewhere, so let me set that down. Okay, yeah. Um, the device verification code is on the bottom of it. So let me input that. Alright, so it says the device has been added, so I'm going to click finish, and we'll see, is it popping up? Alright guys, I'm back and I kind of had to stop the video um, because it was making that noise. Um, remind you that it does have a speaker, so um, I had the phone too close to it. Um, but uh, before I show you, I know you've probably seen a snippet of it before um, I skip to this part. But I'm going to show you uh, what's, inside the, what's inside the app. I mean, you could probably easily just go download this yourself and look, but for some of you who don't have the um, don't uh, have the camera, um, I'll show you. So this is your home page. So once you activate your uh, security camera, 
but it should look something similar to mine. And um, on the bottom, you get uh, three tabs. One says message, home, and more. Uh, messages, probably, they'll pro you probably get messages from um, Anki or Ink themselves. And if you do have, like, um, the alarm notification turned on, you'll get, um, like, alarms or probably screenshots um, or possibly a video, but probably screenshots. Uh, from the security camera with that IPR um, detection, um, if it detects that somebody's in a room, so you get something like that. Um, and then there's a more tab. Um, in the more tab, you get pictures and videos, which is where all your pictures and videos will be stored. And at the bottom, it tells you how much available space you have left on the phone, but um, um, remind you that. Um, you can insert a SD card, a micro SD card, and the security camera. Um, account management, of course, that is all the um, my info um, in there, my name, cell phone number, email, region, and so on. Um, function settings, that's just message push notifications, save device perimeters, and auto receive alarm after powering on. Um, let's see. Uh, feedback and about, and then that's pretty much it for the app. Okay. So, um, this is, I thought you had to click on this to bring up the, um, um, live feed of the security camera. But when you click on this, it just brings up, um, information. Uh, I think just some extra settings. Um, it gives you the time zone where you can set the time zone, um, the date, format, um, alarm notification, which I have disabled right now, um, storage status, and um, for storage status, um, when I first put the SD card in, it didn't say SD card was um, inserted. Um, so I didn't know what the issue was, but I check back in the app later on, and it says something about not um, initialized. So I had to go in and initialize it, and that took about. I mean, you have to start doing this before you're able to save videos, and that took about, I uh, say, about a couple minutes. And then after it's done, it'll say uh, normal, and then that's it. Okay. Um, device version. And um, option to change my password or turn on image encryption. And that's pretty much it. And there's a more tab up here that I haven't even checked out. And I can delete the device if I want to, but I don't want to. Um, okay, now for the live security camera footage. I'm going to click on it. And there I am. Um, now, they have like, well, let me go ahead and show you what's in here. Um you'll get um, at the top tab. Uh, this top tab is, actually I don't know what this is. Let's see what this is. Oh, that's to stop it. All right, can you guys see that very well? Let's focus. Um, that's to stop it from um, uh, live recording. So I can play back and it will load back up. Um, and this right here is the a speaker where I can turn it on. Um, when I turn it on, you probably hear a loud noise, but I'll turn it off really quick. So, um, you can actually hear me through the phone. So I'm gonna try to turn that off. Um, you can actually hear me uh, through the phone because um, there's a mic on that security camera. And uh, this middle uh, button right here is. Um, you can put how many screens you want up in case you had more than one security camera. Uh, you can have 4, 9, 12, or 16. I think 16 is the highest that you could uh, have. So you can have more than one of these security cameras maybe up in every room. Um, and this right here, I think it's just like you can flip the video, I believe. Yeah, you can flip it upside down if you wanted to. Um, just in case you... Uh, the camera is mounted up on the wall upside down or something like that. I guess that's one way you can use it. Um, 
and you can zoom in. So I can zoom in, zoom in, and press it. I think you press it like four times and it'll zoom back out to its regular um, view. Um, and down here at the bottom, these buttons, um, the first one is you can control um, the security camera. So let me turn that over here where you can actually see me recording the security camera. So give me a minute. All right, so um, you can actually uh, control the camera. Um, it's rotation, so let's see. Let's just go this way. That's right. Let's go back. You can even turn it up. Turn it down. And uh, let's go back up a little. And it can even go all the way around. So, I'm gonna, um, you get you you get it. So I'm gonna turn it all the way back around. All right. Um. Okay, so I'm gonna um, when you get done with that, you can just exit out of that. Now the next one is a microphone, and for some reason I can't seem to get this to work. So when I press it, oh, there it goes. Um, before it wasn't working for me. So while I'm talking through um my phone, you can actually hear me through here. So um, let's say like they gave a little um example on the um, product page where you had a child you could talk to them talk to them maybe while you're not home uh through there so that's pretty cool um before the the microphone or this wasn't working on here but it's working now i don't know if you could hear from from the camera or not but um there is audio coming out of this out of the uh security camera so i don't know if you can hear it Testing, testing, one, two, three. Like if I talk through here, microphone is by on the front. I'm talking, talking, talking through here. Through here, you can actually see my my big forehead. Talking, talking, talking. I'm actually talking through here. All right. Okay. All right, so I'm going to exit out of that. So once you exit out of that, it turns the microphone off. Okay, so next up, uh, this one right here is thanks to take a um, screenshot. So let's see. Yeah, as you can see in the corner over here, it took a picture. And then it goes away. And for this, this records video. Um, I'll do a simple video and I'll put that at the end. I'll show you that later. Um, other thing it also has is like, you know, it says it has uh, 1080p. And as you can see, I'm already on, um, I believe I'm already on 1080p. So let me click it. Let's see. Yeah, okay, yeah, here it goes. So you have HD, standard, and basic. So let me show you what, I'm already on the highest one right now, which is 1080p. Um, we have standard. So let's click standard. You have standard. Actually, I'm not even going to do it. I'm just going to show um, sample videos of each one at the end. And I'll let you um, um, I'll let you judge on the footage. Um, so let's click on that. And that's all you get in the app. Oh, also at the bottom, there's a gallery. So... Um, any videos and stuff that you record might show up here. Um, they'll probably show up here. I think they'll show up in here. And it even has a little calendar where you can go back and check. Um, if you recorded a video, say, last week, you could probably go back and check that. Um, and I think that's pretty much it. And there's a settings within here. 
and that basically just shows what I already showed before. Alright, so right now I'm going to go ahead and uh, record um, some sample footage in uh, each um, uh, using the HD standard and the basic. Alright guys, so I forgot to mention um, the um, night vision, so I'm actually going to turn um, these lights off, because um, I'm still not sure how night vision is activated, so I'm going to turn these lights off.
so. So let's see, I just turned all of the lights off. So let me see. All right, there we go. So, um, night vision is now on. Um, all right. As you can see, I don't know if you can see those um, lights. So, night vision is activated. So, I guess it senses when um, um, darkness, I guess. Um, but it's activated, so... So it is recording.